good morning. We're back in Puerto Venus and um, coming in from a different side today. Beautiful day today. The 11th of September. Going to be another 30 degrees. Parrots are making a, a racket. A lot of places have got hundreds of these scooters. Um, Puerto Banu seems to have three. Don't know what you feel about those things. I have actually got my own, but I only ever use it if I'm out in the motorhome. It's a big dog. He big dog, isn't he? Alright, we're in the stop. Yep, thank you. It's uh, 10.30 in the morning, so it's pretty quiet. Has anybody gone to the beach yet? Maybe. There's... Uh, La Pesquera fish restaurant. Five guys opened up in Puerto Banus um, a couple of years ago, I think. Very nice. And we're back. And this time I'm going to get all the way to the end because in the last video I didn't uh, get to uh, go right to the end of the pool. Well, I, I actually did, I videoed it, but, but for some reason there was a problem with the didn't actually show up, look. So we've got a nice Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I don't know much about these, to be fair. Some nice big calipers on there. Lamborghini Metallic orange Don't know the exact colour Matching leather interior as well. Orange. Beautiful. Nice range over there as well. Okay, yes. Now that, I'd prefer that. I'd rather have that than that. Tell me what you think. Hola, buenas. So we've got, this is Astral, 
I showed you in the last video. This is where you go for your cocktails. And then we've got Banus Beach, which is a restaurant that will serve you on their terrace or on the beach. Now, I've come in today to uh, do a few shorts because last time I was here there weren't uh, many nice cars and there normally are lots of nice cars. We've got an AVRS here, black. I do like these. Very nice. The size of those calipers on the front. The little tinsy ones on the back. That you don't need big ones on the back. RS3. Beautiful. Nice car. Well, I will post this on the vlog. Not sure how many views it's going to get because I've just done one. But as I say, I'm only in here for, to do some shorts. Look at this beautiful Bentley. Look at the carbon fibre stone chip there. Seems to have a problem there as well. And the spoiler. Wow. Mansori. Again, another Mansori. Beautiful. And on the wing mirrors as well. Look at that. The bottom. Beautiful. the carbon fibre everywhere. Gorgeous. There's a guy over there. Wave. Sit down and change the battery on this. <laughs> okay, let's take a puke. I'll tell you what, it's busy, isn't it? What time is it? Let's have a look and see what time it is. 20 past 11. Okay, I'm going to change the battery. Got a red light flashing. We'll be back in a moment.
if you can get in. I did go in that nightclub there once. I don't know if, if you're from England, uh, Theopathetus used to be one of the dragons then guys, he was in there having a, having a drink. So here's this lovely blue Ferrari. I'm not too sure about this one, I mean it's gorgeous. I wouldn't say no, but it's uh, not my go-to Ferrari I don't think. Amor Fantasia, Let's see what the prices are on this. Very reasonable. Oh, a lovely place, that. That's the one we showed you earlier. And you can sit near to all the millionaires while they're sat on their deck. So what a lot of people tend to do when they have a walk through the port, they'll forget the back part. I'll quickly show you. And if you turn down, there you go, I missed it. I'm not sure this is the entrance actually. You've got the Sky Lounge, the Benabola Hotel, as you can see. You've got the back end there. I'm sorry, I'm not going to show you what um, I showed you in the last video. I'll just uh, fill in the blanks that I missed. I thought I recorded. I'm only really here just to uh, do a few shorts so if you're not interested in the vlogs that I do you may want to follow for the shorts because I'm in the uh, perfect spot in Europe to film nice cars so if you're into your cars or any nice or unusual vehicle my shorts will be of interest and then just don't watch the vlogs fancy an ice cream what's this one called piku there you go you have an idea For a man, yeah. Nice alpha. UK plates. It's a nice car that. Coming in or going out? 
You can hop on this, it takes you to Marbella, or you can uh, jump on it in Marbella and come to Benus. We'll do both. Can't be a very long trip, maybe 20 minutes max, I would have thought. So if you've got uh, seafaring legs, you'd be right on there. As you can see, there's a queue ready to go to Marbella. And I would imagine there's the same queue at the other end. We'll have a stroll in Marbella as well today or possibly next week. So we're drawing to the end of the season now, so I've got time to film. I'm too busy in the summer with what we do here. I'm still relatively busy, but I'm going to try and really push out these uh, videos, vlogs. Nice Bentley Cabriolet there, look. Unfortunately, I can't get in there and film it. And there's a Ferrari up there as well. I don't know if you can see that. I did have a friend who had a boat here. Um, he moved it back to Mallorca because quite honestly there is not a lot to see at sea down here you know there's no little bays there's no nice little places to stop it's just beach after beach unlike Mallorca which has uh, the perfect views little bays that you can stop at you're lucky enough to own one of these. It's really starting to uh, get quite warm here. Uh, I think it's the 11th today, 11th of September. So I'll try and get this out tonight. If not, it'll be tomorrow. For any of the vlogs that I do, um, or shorts, are new. You know, I'm not one of these uh, post things weeks months after they were filmed try to get them out as soon as possible so it's the 11th of September today AMG SLS and uh, metallic black I think it's metallic Yeah, it is a metallic black. Lovely. G63 Brabus, I love the colour. I like my grey cars. V8 by turbo. We have had a little rain recently, so there's a few dirty cars, and uh, when it rains, sometimes we get what we call a kalima, which is a bit of sand from the Sahara Desert that blows over, and then when it rains, it drops on your nice, shiny new vehicles, unfortunately. Well, we'll need to stop for a drink at some point. little tiny bottle of coke, five euros. And to me at the moment, it's worth five euros. It is hot. So five euros for a tiny little bottle of coke.
anything more? No, I'm okay at the moment, I think. Thank, Thank you. you. Gracias. So, this is what they've got on the menu. You can pause this and have a look. I mean, it's not going to be cheap, it's Porta Banus. So, there's an idea of what they do. And it's called uh, Breeze. Puerto Banus. And it's really nice because it's on the entrance to the port. Stopping in there, have a little drink. Have a nice, cool, refreshing Coke for five euros. Yeah, but in the sort of cafe. Show you the beach. And it looks pretty round. It's all nicely set up. I've got a few more minutes left before I need to go. So I've just parked up here, two euros, takes me to about 20 past one. And uh, we'll take you up here a little way, show you. So over there in the distance, you could walk Marbella, and then back the other way, San Pedro. As you can see the beach is lovely and clean as you would expect and it's a scorchio day today police police patrol in the place good to see when you came when we had the one that you when you had the And there's the promenade that takes you all the way to Marbella, which you can see in the distance over there, down there and across. You do get the odd vehicle, but it's normally the police or the Juntamento, uh, as they call it, the local council. Apart from that, nobody else should be on here. Push bikes, obviously. I don't really have a problem with scooters down here beach restaurants in Spain you may see the word Cheringuito you think it's a chain of something if you don't speak Spanish or you're not aware Cheringuito basically means beach bar so I hope you enjoyed this one as I say if you're into your cars you'll find the shorts are all vehicles that I film. Best place to be. And lots of nice cars. There's a right racket going on. And there's the famous statue. And there's the statue donated by Russia. Not sure why. You can take your guesses. And um, don't forget to follow. Do with some more followers. And if you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It doesn't matter. If you're Spanish and you're watching this, I do speak Spanish, so uh, you can leave a comment. Good or bad. And we'll catch you in the next one.
And there we go. See you soon.